Hi Virgo, it's Elle here to do your April 2021 love reading. Uh, this will be a general reading, so you know how that goes. If it resonates for you, please like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. Um, all links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's get into this Virgo. All right, so Virgo, um, thank you Lord God for blessing these cards for Virgo. Thank you for an accurate message for Virgo. Thank you, Lord. All right, let's get into it. Let's see what is going on in your love sector, Virgo. What's going on for Virgo? All right, we've got six of wands. So you could be having some success in love or getting the recognition, the praise that you deserve or that you feel like you you, you need or you deserve. Uh, maybe for some... You know the work that you're doing in the relationship um, maybe someone's just happy to have you you could be getting a proposal here of some sort now a proposal can be of course a proposal of marriage um perspective jumped out or the hangman so i don't know if uh things are kind of at a halt now someone's taking a break uh, someone's uh looking at things from a different perspective in terms of why hasn't this happened or why is it not happening or why hasn't it happened just why hasn't it happened already or why haven't i had or somebody's just kind of letting things work autonomously hands off um, maybe even pulling back trying to see what is what's really going on here before they actually actually communicate before they actually jump back in and communicate how they're thinking and feeling uh, so you may be kind of checked out just a bit. Uh, let's see. Or or the other person is. How does Virgo feel about this connection? Uh, the Knight of Cups. Okay, so you feel like you keep giving your love, but you, you're you also guarded because you understand that this cup is not always accepted in the manner that you feel like it should be accepted in. It should be accepted and then reciprocated and then it should be then promoted and and into something else into a full-on relationship or a marriage or an engagement something to where you just feel like you're not getting exactly what you want um let's see how does your person you feel like also um maybe somebody trying to sweep you off your feet or uh, date you or ask you out but that's as far as it goes there's not the real leveling up um stability that you need okay so your person is the king of swords could be libra gemini aquarius and the devil so your person just feels like um maybe they don't have enough or there's not enough or um they feel like this is not a good choice right now um something about uh, money, timing, choices. They don't want to feel trapped or bound or stuck. Um, they also don't want to feel like they don't want to trap you or put you in a maybe a situation that won't be as um, it won't be feasible to you getting what you want. Maybe monogamy. This person feels kind of low vibrational. They just want to have fun. They uh playfulness materialistic um your person could feel like this is a toxic relationship or you, you guys do something over and over again maybe you argue about the same thing over and over again there's an energy of someone being met with love and the other being met with truth the truth of the matter um someone giving their absolute truth their truth not exactly how it is but their truth someone is seeing clearly with the king of swords and the devil here maybe someone's seeing that this is just it's a bit too toxic for them or it's not going to work or that they don't want to be bound or maybe being with you is bondage or vice versa this is how you feel
a person could feel like being being with you is bondage or they feel like you're in a toxic relationship if they're outside of the connection um you have the toxicity someone feels as if the other person is sneaky or, or trying to sneak around and have a second chance with them someone feel this is a lot of distance between uh a party here i don't know a third party or an outside relationship yeah there's a lot of sneakiness deception underhandedness somebody masquerading as if they are something else or as if the relationship is something else but in turn um someone doesn't know how to get single or be single There's like two different stories here. So there could be children here. Somebody wants to manifest a reconciliation. Um, but it, they could be sending messages or um, vibrations out into the universe to that person. Like that they want them to come back. But they're already either couple, married, or in a situation. Somebody's on the outside of this. They haven't gotten over it, uh, but they need to get over it because this person is not, they can't find a way to get out of something or to move away from something or they don't want to. Someone, there's an energy of someone feeling like they're going to be rescued from a relationship, a job. No, you have to be the agency of change. With the Eight of Swords here, it's like somebody's giving up agency and they're like, like they're waiting for it. You know, someone to rescue them. Okay, uh, Virgo, if it resonated with you, go over to the website, book your own reading there. Take advantage of the text question where you can text the question to the number below. Um, you can pay for your question on your mobile device and receive the answer to your question on your mobile device. Thank you, Virgo. Many blessings to you. Take